thank you guys so much for joining us today we are heading to wild florida it's the world's only airboat gator and drive through safari we are so excited and we're so glad that you are here to take the ride with us so the drive took about 40 to 45 minutes it was light traffic when we were headed that way So the brochure that they provide has tons and tons of information um, on there you'll see about the gator park the animal encounters which is pretty amazing but we didn't go in there um, just due to covid and safety reasons however they also have a chomp grill which we stopped and grabbed some food to go and it was pretty good they also have gator for those of you who want to eat some gator <laughs> and the attraction start immediately this little guy met us at the gate as soon as the gate opened um, this place is absolutely gorgeous they have done a great job of creating a safe calm environment yet an awesome experience so let's enjoy the show together The cool thing is you're able to come in here as many times as you want on the day that you purchase your tickets. Your wristbands um, is what they give you. the drive through portion of the safari you are not supposed to feed any of the animals you're not supposed to lure them to your vehicle in any way there were a couple times that we had um, animals coming to our vehicle even though we don't have any food um, and we weren't trying to get them there but they'll show up but there are attractions within this whole compound that you are able to feed alligators if you want um, you can feed the ostriches if you want. It's a different area and it's a walk up area. Inside the legend of the brochure that they give you, it gives you um, some options and some shows and entertainment that's going on. So it tells you the different times. On our second pass, I'm um, going through, they were actually feeding on those platforms, like the one that you see there with the mama. Um, they're, they sprinkled out seeds or whatever it is that they're eating and it looks like everybody's pretty much eating the same thing so I don't know what that is but um, they did put out food for each set of animals now some of them it was funny to see them in the small corrals where you know they should not be um, where the smaller animals are eating or bullying quote unquote the other the smaller animals to get majority of the food so it was pretty cool to see um, them interacting with each other we even came across an ostrich 
who was trying to eat with the zebras. And the zebra kept hitting um, the ostrich in the head with his paw or arm or it was the front leg um, just to get him out of there. And that ostrich said, no, I'm eating too. So this was pretty awesome. My son actually um, yelled in excitement when we first arrived, just learning where we were and to be able to see the different animals kind of in their environment. Definitely felt like these guys needed their own music.
what an amazing sight to see. We had such a great time here at this safari. They also provide you with this cool little scavenger hunt so that you can mark off all the animals that you see. Just up the road, the same road that you traveled to get there, you will find the Chop House Grill. Um, it also has the attractions over there. You can go back into like their little zoo area. Um, there are some wonderful seating, some rocking chairs. Like it's an amazing space um, that they have created. You'll also get on the boat um, if you do the boat tour over there. And then there's also a dock down here where you can put your own boat into the water and they have some selected parking for you to put your RV or put your equipment or put your truck or whatever your trailer um, over to the side. So it's pretty accommodating and those things you won't pay anything. It's just a space for you to be able to get out on the lake. So I think this was a very cool experience. If you're ever here in Florida, if you come to Orlando, you've seen the parks, what else is there to do? Take the drive to this drive through safari because you will not be sorry. Leave a comment below of the, your favorite animal. Mine was the giraffe. Um, my son was excited about the ostrich. Um, but you guys leave which one you enjoy below. Thank you. We will see you next time. Comment, like, and subscribe.